if I, it's the way I like it, that's the way I do it. Catherine Davis always wished she had the time to paint. But when you're a mother of four with one on the way, there's no time for hobbies. Until now. I can lose myself and forget about the whole timing thing and just sit and paint. And next thing I know, I look up, it's time for meds, you know. I, <laughs> it helps. So how's it been? Oh, it's been fine. Yeah. Yeah. You could call her the artist in residence at St. Joseph Regional Medical Center. She's been living at the South Bend Hospital for nearly two months, ever since her water broke at 23 weeks, way too early for baby. What we try to do is lengthen the pregnancy as long as we can, and she's exceeded all expectations at this point. Everybody has their own personal opinions and their own stuff they like and don't like. After her first week here, she told her husband to bring over her paint stuff. She suddenly had some time on her hands. If I didn't have something to do, I would have went completely nuts because I'm so used to going all day long. She'll paint just about anything and finishes about one a day. Most of it has anything to do with sea, sand, and water that I can actually come up with just because I want to be out in it. And that one I actually really like, the one that's up in the mirror, because I like the red bucket. I'm just going to brighten this up a little. The hobby is, well, just what the doctor ordered. I think it's therapeutic. What also gets her through the day are the ultrasound pictures of her baby girl. I started getting a picture with every ultrasound and putting it in the window. <laughs> and it actually helps. I get to watch her grow and it keeps me in bed. Otherwise, I would have went home a long time ago. <laughs> Any predictions on her new daughter's personality? She is going to be so ornery. I mean, she is going to be, I, I can tell. For the South Bend Tribune and News 22, I'm Gwen O'Brien.